Hello everybody. Please sit down quietly and take out a bubble note sheet or a blank sheet of paper and something to write with. We are going to review the endocrine system from the adolescent unit briefly. Please remember that your adolescent and nutrition test is tomorrow. Please study. So what is responsible for all of the changes during puberty? Puberty is the time when you develop physical characteristics of adults of your own gender. Does anyone remember the endocrine system? Let's take a closer look. Some of the glands in the endocrine system or the glands that are in your endocrine system are the pituitary gland, also known as the master gland, the hypothalamus, the thyroid gland, parathyroid glands, adrenal glands, thymus gland, pancreas, two ovaries in females, and there's two testes in males. This is another view of the endocrine system. The pituitary gland secretes human growth hormone and follicle stimulating hormone. These hormones stimulate physical growth and the development of the reproductive organs. Adrenal glands secrete cortical sex hormones, which help regulate the development of sex characteristics that signal the physical differences between males and females. Now let's take a look at the ovaries and the testes. The ovaries are the female reproductive organ. They secrete estrogen and progesterone. Estrogen affects the development of female sex characteristics while progesterone allows the uterus to prepare for pregnancy. In males, the testes are the male reproductive glands. The testes secrete testosterone, which affects sperm production and the development of male sex characteristics. So let's break it down. The endocrine system, which is, consists of a series or a system of glands, secretes hormones that causes the changes in males and females during puberty, which occurs during adolescence. So what are the female glands that are responsible for the development of female sex characteristics? The ovaries. And what are the male glands that are responsible for the development of male sex characteristics? The testes. What two hormones are secreted by the ovaries? progesterone and estrogen, and what hormone is secreted in the testes? Testosterone. So let's take a closer look. The hormones in males and females. Testosterone is the male or the is the male hormone which is found in boys. They do have a tiny bit of estrogen. And progesterone and estrogen are the female hormone. However, girls do have a tiny bit of testosterone. So who has what? Males have testosterone. We can refer to them as Tommy testosterone. And females have estrogen and progesterone. We can refer to them as Ella estrogen and Patty progesterone. So what changes occurred from childhood and adulthood? So think about your personal life cycle. Some of the changes that occur in both males and females, or the changes that do occur in both males and females, are acne, body hair, increase in perspiration, and pubic hair. The male changes are increased levels of male hormones, facial hair, deeper voice, broadened shoulders to make more of a Y shape, muscle development, reduction of sperm, enlargement of external genitals. For females, there's increased levels of the female hormones, development of breasts, increase in body fat, formation of mature eggs, wider hips, and the beginning of their menstrual cycle. Please review at home using Quizlet. You can also refer to Google Classroom to look up your study board. Please be ready to raise your hand and share your answers to the quick review. Thank you.